introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, he weighed in at 75 kilograms flat, holding a record of three wins and two defeats, training out of Lion's Den Academy, give it up for Chris Morris. And introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he weighed in at 74.5 kilograms, holding an undefeated record of one win and zero defeats. Training out of integrated MMA, give it up for Darcy Johnson. And when our action begins, our referee in charge, Phil Cassidy. First assignment for Phil Cassidy here on our prelims. Chris Morris fighting out of the blue corner, Darcy Johnson in the red. Right, we'll see if he can remain Fire undefeated Fire. as an amateur mixed martial artist. Round one. Chris Morris takes the centre. Right. Yeah, it's a low blow <laughs> straight off the bat. Great start. To the bat. Southport Orthodox, you often get that in the kicking exchange. And here's Chris Morris showing his intentions early, trying to drag this one to the man. And why wouldn't you? I'm sorry, there's Darcy Johnson trying to drag it to the man. And Chris Morris, the man who's finished his two wins within the first 20 seconds. So here we go. Darcy Morris trying his damnedest to drag this to the ground and a suplex out the back door. You'll love a little bit of that. Pinning the, the wrist with his knee. Some good stiff hard ground and pound with the left leg. Steps through into half guard. Hasn't really locked that bottom leg down. So if Morris wants to regard he can he can he just needs to get off onto his hips some good athletic grappling from darcy johnson looking to secure the back early but chris morris pops up on top ben yeah but he's just chaining stuff together i mean he's on a kimura on the on the far side now um he's just full of energy and he's just going from spot to spot to spot and uh doing some some cool stuff and I, I like to see him like going out there and trying stuff that he's been working on in the gym not the most high percentage stuff in the world but um well, that's the problem when you go for that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, that's right under now. That's deep. That's very deep, Big T. Well, that may just do it. It's lasted longer than 20 seconds for Chris Morris as we count down the final minute and a half of round one. But don't count him out just yet. Darcy Johnson still fighting those hands, and he's no stranger to this type of grind, fighting out of integrated MMA, but in a tough spot of bother so far. He's just, he's very high up the back, isn't he, Ben? He's very high up the back, and he's a long way away from his corner on the opposite side of the cage, unable to receive instruction. That's a good adjustment there from Morris. Comes up on top, says, hey, mate, I'll get this one out of the way with me hands. Don't worry about the jiu-jitsu nonsense. And half guard now, he's given up the underhook. So let's see if Johnson can skirt out to the side, use the cage to start framing and getting back to his feet. Puts the... Puts the knee shield in. He can use that to create some space as Morris punches. Oh, these are but big, it's big old punches. Phil Cassidy will not let Johnson go on with this. If he cannot protect himself intelligently, Chris Morris with 30 seconds left to work on top and in control. I've been very impressed with the way that Chris uses his frames to oh. land damage on. That'll do it, Chris Morris. First round of TKO, it took him longer than 20 seconds, but he got it done, handing Darcy Johnson his first loss of his young career. What a performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee in charge, Phil Cassidy, called a stop to the contest at two minutes and 39 seconds of the very first round, declaring your winner via TKO in the blue corner.